I have been reading about anti-missionary terrorist organizations like Yad Lachim in Israel, who harass and sometimes murder fellow Jews should they ever come to believe in Jesus. If you think about the excuses Yad Lachim makes for its actions, the reasoning is pretty ridiculous. It goes something like this. Messianics are a threat to Israel. Their presence in Israel is a corrupting influence in our society. They come to the area on false pretensions and attempt to Christianize us, undermining our values, our communities, and stealing our children's souls. We have a right to defend our beliefs and act against those who would destroy them. Their very existence in our land is a threat to us. It would not have bothered us if those Messianics had lived anywhere else, but their encroachment into our territory is an act of aggression and must be stopped by any means necessary. This sounds familiar for some reason. What happens if we replace Messianics with Jews, Israel with the Middle East, and Christianize with Westernize? Here's what we get. Jews are a threat to the Middle East. Their presence in the Middle East is a corrupting influence on our society. They come to the area on false pretensions and attempt to Westernize us, undermining our values, our communities, and stealing our children's souls. We have a right to defend our beliefs and act against those who would destroy them. Their very existence in our land is a threat to us. It would not have bothered us if those Jews had lived anywhere else, but their encroachment into our territory is an act of aggression and must be stopped by any means necessary. Wow, that sounds like the exact same reasoning that Palestinian terrorist organizations use to justify their actions. I guess this explains a lot. Shalom. Welcome.